the poems. Uh, this poem I have read on many occasions, many a time. Uh, this is very close to my heart. This is the the poem is titled uh, Death Rattle Flap. They forgot to put my body on fire. They forgot to put my body on fire on freshly chopped logs of wood on oil packing and boiling. They forgot the charm of cotton ball plugs, the sight of wetted white petals of fattened flowers, the absent-minded twirl of smoke chains, incense sticks, the sonorous trail of holy hymns, crackling sounds of earthen pots and above all, the communal moaning around the box. Instead, they hurled me down inside a pit, laboriously excavated, dark and deep, and instantaneously covered it up with far-setting slurry, with a slate of hands that can be defeated only by mystic magicians at work. So, I existed there, frosted miles below. From where you are waging your philosophical wars on trains against commuters, struggling to reach their office on time, commissioning ecstatic cocaine soirees on yachts and rocks, executing orgies with strangers on a plane, stealing antiquity from private museums of novio billionaires. For you had told me once, I will blow up my life, indoctrinating me with the scent of your body and introducing me to the nucleus of this explosive club, Death Rattle Club. What holds me here is an intricate web of undefined silence and darkness so pure in form in this marsh of soil, water, plant roots and rotting flesh. You worry sometimes, don't you, struggling in sleep? Do I remember your face and touch as I crossed over the perimeter of life? Do I know that your face is one among their faces? Do I remember all their faces as distinctly as I should? Do I remember our plot of both blowing up our lives? My life in the sharing it with a fellow cops. Remembering and forgetting are complex phenomena even otherwise. More so after you have crossed the gate. Sometimes, nowadays, I will to laugh at our words. Words crafted out of beliefs, mostly non-beliefs, yet preached with so much intensity, precision and timing, a way of time passing for all of us at this explosive club. Death Rabbit. I just read out one more poem and then take leave. Uh, this is also from Winter Poems. It's a very small poem. In fact, uh, this poem was addressed to the Jenny, my wife. Uh, <clears throat> Between the stars and blades of grass, you lie down like a magic wand. Between the stars and blades of grass, you lie down like a magic wand, a glittering tower of light. At dusk, you were a ship loaded with emerald and cobalt pearls, wavering and simmering in the eastern wind. The dogged morning comes. You are the face of an ocean where I can drown endlessly in my burning boats of thousand feet. Thank you.